You've almost finished your pull-on pants with the joy pull-on pants sew along. Or maybe you are completely finished and now you're asking, what do I get to sew next? Hi everyone, I'm Glenda with SureFit Designs and now many of you know me as Glenda the Good Stitch. Today I'd like to introduce you to the wide array of educational and informational resources that we have available for you. First of all, we have our streaming video website which is called SoFitAcademyOnline.com and very recently we put up a series of pants sew-alongs and it addressed that very basic question, what do I do next? Number one, is a pull-on pant. Now you're saying, well I just did a pull-on pants with Joy. And that's right, you did. But in the pull-on pants sew along that I did, you will see elastic around the entire top of the pants. So that was sew along number one. Sew along number two showed you how to do a pair of leggings. A lot of ladies are wearing leggings these days. They're done out of extremely stretchy fabric. You need to know how to work with your pattern, your Sherpa Designs pattern, and size down because your fabric has so much stretch in it. And that's what I cover in that particular sew along. And style number three was a faced waist edge pant that looks like this. And it's done out of a woven fabric. So between our knit fabrics and our woven fabrics, you do have lots of choices in those particular sew-alongs. Next, we have the complete instruction book that is inside your SureFit Designs pants kit, which all of you watching likely already have at this point in time. And in the fifth edition instruction book, on page 17, you're going to see a pants leg style chart. And on this chart, you're going to see many different leg width designs as well as leg length designs. Now there is another video in YouTube that addresses this chart and gives you more details about how to make these different design changes. And so again, so many different options for you in terms of designing. I'll give you a link for that in the show more comments at the bottom of this particular video. We also have a designing book called Pants It Mix and Multiply. Now there are six different designs in here and at the back of the designing book there is a DVD included which gives you all of the how-to steps for designing each of these specific pants patterns. But I'd like to show you most of them. We'll take a look first of all at the first one which is a, an elasticized waistline. And you're saying, well, I just did an elasticized waistline. And yes, that's true, but this is very different. And it's because the elastic is not in a casing per se. It's not loose within a casing. What it is, is that I built the waistline up from the waist level, only one inch, and then I incorporated the elastic turned it over and then stitched in the ditch. Now this is done with 100% woven fabric without any stretch. And because it doesn't have any stretch in it, that elastic has so little give to it that it's not enough to pull up over my hips. So the instructions are teaching you how to put in the invisible zipper. So now you have both options to get into your pants, the zipper and the little bit of elastic at the waistline. Now in that design book you'll see that these particular pants have a flared leg and I've done them that way but I also wanted a thin leg or a narrower leg on these pants and so just because I might give you one design option there as in terms of leg width if you want it wider or even narrower than what I've done you certainly can do that. Another design that is found within the Pants That Mix and Multiply book is this crop leg pant. And here you're going to notice that the pocket detail is being dropped down from the waistline. One of the videos that Joy recently did showed you her pull-on pants with the elastic back and they were her red ones. And she put 
as inseam pocket on the side seam. And then she said, but look, that inseam pocket can tend to gape open a little bit and make me look a little bit wider in the hip line. And then she referenced this particular design to show how to do the pocket that comes down from the waistline. You won't get any gapping at your hip line because your hip line is secure with the full complete seam. So that's the crop leg pant. Another one that you'll find in Pants That Mix and Multiply are called the high-waisted pants. They look like this and they have this pretty little V right at the waistline. This design is particularly good for any of you real tall ladies. Another one that's in Pants and Mix and Multiply is our Yoga Travel and Comfort Pants. Now they are made out of a knit fabric and here you're going to see that they do have an elastic waistband as well but here it is a two inch wide elastic and the waistline has actually been dropped down so that this rides right underneath your waist more of a contoured waistline and the directions are full and complete in the Pants That Mix and Multiply book. Now we also have informational leaflets that are called fashion leaflets and they look like this. You'll find them in our website under the shop tab that says um, digital sewing patterns. The first design that I'm going to show you is the easy wrap pant and this is a real real fun pant and very comfortable pant to wear and that's because it has a completely velcroed waistline. I'll turn to this other close-up camera so that you can really see this and you're going oh my gosh does that ever look huge? Well the back has elastic, the front has velcro and you just wrap it as snugly as you want it to be on your waistline. For any of you who are members of our Facebook group you'll know that last year a number of ladies started sewing these easy wrap pants posted all kinds of photographs of them. They just love them. They are so incredibly comfortable. Another fashion leaflet that we have shows you how to do the collot or the divided skirt. Now I'll pick up one of these at a time. You can see that it's got the big divided leg in it. And so whenever you see something that looks like a skirt but it's two legs to it, you know that it was done from your pants pattern because it does have that crotch line. That was a polyester. This one is 100% wool. In fact, it, I believe it's a Pendleton wool. It's got a beautiful big pleat coming down the front and of course done from your pants pattern. And this one is done out of a polyester as well in a gorgeous paisley it's a very, very soft, slinky fabric and drapes beautifully when it's on. And so that's leaflet number two for the divided skirt and leaflet number eight is for the easy wrap pants. Now, another thing of course that you can do are jeans and we do have our video and DVD tutorial called Jeans Behind the Scenes and of course you can make them long or short or as tight as you want to with all the fly front and the watch pocket there or the, I think that's called the, the coin pocket and then the regular hand pocket that's up at the top. So you'll find that on our Jeans DVD. And of course that was one of the gifts that both our Canadian and South African distributors are giving for the Joy Pants pull, al pull along, sew along. And I also have the children's kit out here and you're wondering why I'm talking about this for design ideas. Well, it's because the instructions for some of the designs in here are totally applicable for adult clothing. One of the things that we've seen become very popular again after years of not being in the fashion industry is a jumpsuit, except for today they're calling it a romper. And this is done from the children's kit instructions. So here I've got my Surefit Design shirt kit on the top. 
and I've got my pants on the bottom and they're joined together at the waistline to create a jumpsuit. And another design that you'll find in the children's kit is the no side seam pants. And so when I take a look at this display at the side seam area, if I can pull the fabric apart there, I know it's a little bit hard on this print fabric, but you'll see that there isn't a side seam here. It's a very, very comfortable lounge pant to make and all found within the children's kit. So lots of flexibility here with the design ideas. Of course, the patterns are suited to children and teenagers before they grow into the adult patterns. So the whole purpose of this video was to give you this wide array of resources that SureFit Designs provides for you so that you can keep sewing happily with your SureFit Designs pants pattern and know that all of the styles that you choose for your body are going to fit you properly. I'd like to close by once again inviting you to join our YouTube channels. If you haven't already, make sure to join Joy Bernhardt's channel, and it is her name that she uses for her channel reference, Joy Bernhardt. And of course, for SureFit Designs, my channel is SureFit Designs. I invite you to join that, like and subscribe. You get instant notifications of when we put up new videos. And also make sure you join the SureFit Designs mailing list. Again, you'll get notifications of any promotions that we're doing and new videos that we put out. Our Facebook group is one other resource for you. If you happen to be a Facebook fan, make sure to join and we will approve you. Thanks so much for watching.